Hi guys, this is I'm Stark and today we are looking at the carbon cycle. So the carbon cycle is basically where there is all the, the same amount of carbon in the world at all times. It can be locked away or it can be out in the open, but it never changes in the atmosphere. So we're going to start off, you can start there in any way, but we're going to start off when an insect, an animal or a plant dies. What happens is the microorganisms feed on this dead plant, insect or animal, and then they release carbon through respiration. So these microorganisms are the the things that are releasing carbon through respiration. Then the plants take in this carbon through photosynthesis. Watch my other video if you don't know what photosynthesis is. Then, so that is one way of which can happen. And this goes over and over again. So the, uh, the plants take in carbon um, by photosynthesis, then the animal will take in that carbon, then the animal will die, the microorganisms will um, then eat, uh, feast on the animal through um, decomposition, and then they will release this carbon back into the atmosphere by, uh, by respiration. The other way it can happen is when an animal dies, it fossilizes. Then these fossils are then used for fossil fuels, and then when these fossil fuels are burnt, they, it, it causes combustion, which is then releasing carbon back into the atmosphere, which of course, as we know in this modern world, is not very good because it is then causing global warming. But that is the way that it happens. So thank you for watching and please check out my website and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you and goodbye.